What is going on YouTube? You're watching Next Gen Speed. Today we got some more carbon fiber mods for the interior for the Camaro SS, which is the 6th Gen Camaro, which includes some of these parts right here. Now the first one I'm going to go over is these carbon fiber window panel covers, which covers the window switch covers on each door. These are a simple installation, just pretty much just the peel and stick, just like a sticker. As you can see, this pretty much covers the entire door panel of the car, including the window part covers. It's just a simple mod just to bring out the interior of the car and make it pop out a lot more. As you can see, these feature the hydro drip carbon fiber plastic pieces. These aren't true carbon fiber, but they are, but they are pretty much original, just like carbon fiber. It's a very high quality finish with them. It's very nicely made. Now the next ones we're going to go over is the start and stop button cover. Now this cover covers the start and stop button that turns on your car, obviously. It's a simple installation, just like before, it's just simple like a sticker. And this goes over and it kind of slides in. And the cool thing about this one is that it actually features a Transformers option. Now if you look closely to it, you can see a little Transformers logo embedded into it. Which is a little cool option just to make your car kind of like a Transformer, but... It's a little, little cool option we offer if you guys want. And now the next thing we have are these speaker door surround covers. As you can see, there's two pieces for each door. And these simply just go around the edge of the speaker and give it a little design and just add something nice to it. Now these are the same deals before, I have the double sided tape for easy installation. So I pretty much just peel it off and stick it on, so. All right guys, and the last piece we're adding is the center shifter trim bezel. As you can see the same carbon fiber as before. This one goes in the center console area around the shifter. It's a nice piece. And this is the last piece we'll be adding to the interior of the Camaro for now until we want to add some more. But we think after this one, it'll be enough carbon fiber for the interior, not to make it too much, just to make it nice and <clears throat> just to make it nice without going overboard on it. About to head to the garage right now, check them out, and get these installed. All right, so we're officially back in the garage. Show sure you guys some other parts I've installed. What I've installed so far includes this dash panel piece right here. This radio trim cover that's also in carbon fiber. Install some steering wheel trim in carbon fiber, as you guys see there. Trim paddle shifter extensions also available at nextgenspeed.com. So first off, I'm gonna get to cleaning things, and since we're gonna be installing the start and stop piece right here, we we'll start cleaning that first. Then around the speaker door trims, and then the window switch panels, as you see right here. Now to get these installed correctly, you want to get a little mix of alcohol and water, and a microfiber towel. Now what you want to do is put your solution of alcohol and water, and you put it on the towel, and just clean up the places where you're about to install it. To make sure it's as clean as possible, make sure there's no dust, no dirt, or nothing on there, to make sure it sticks 100% and as good as they can. So I'm gonna take my solution and alcohol and water, just rub it down a little bit, all around the area, make sure it's clean as possible. Then I'm just gonna do the same deal on the window switch panels and around the door surrounds, around the speakers. And the window switch panels, the same deal. Just make sure it's clean as possible. Dry it off with the opposite side. Make sure there's no water or nothing on there. And for the door speaker surround cover, just to give you an idea, this lines up right in there around the speaker. Just gonna clean that up and then get it installed. Now a nice tip to install these items is to use some heat. Now what you want to do is either use a heat gun, hair dryer, or even a lighter. Just add some heat to the adhesive to let it stick as good as it can. So I got my first piece right here, the engine start and stop button cover. I'm just going to peel off the back taping. Now that all the taping is off, I'm going to add some heat to it. I'm gonna wave it around a little bit, not put it too close, not too far. Just skim it, add some heat to it. Just a little bit. 
And now that she's all heated up, just want to simply line it up. Want to make sure the bun is right in the center and line this part up with the radio trim cover. And if you already have the radio trim cover installed, this actually goes around it. You'll see a little lip like that. Just line it up like that. Just want to get as perfect as I can. Then once you line it up, you just want to add some pressure to it, push it down, and every crease in every corner, just to make sure it sticks 100%. And just like that, we got the first part installed. Now we got the window switch panel all cleaned up, ready to go, all the tape taken off. Add some heat to it with the heat gun. Skim it around, go along every edge with a piece of this. I'm just going to add some heat to the window switch panel as it's kind of cold in my garage. And then make sure you put this on the ground so you don't put it on your car on the carpet. And then we get this installed. I just want to go in front like this and follow the line with the window switch. Just line up everything as perfectly as you can. And it's lined up, you just want to add some pressure and push it down. Alright, so now we got the shifter trim in the middle to do which is pretty much just like this overlay. Probably one of the easier pieces in here to put on. As you can see, you got the double-sided tape. Just gonna take that off. Nice and simple, nice and easy. And this honestly might be the last piece I put on the interior of this car for the carbon fiber. Okay, I like it, but I'm not trying to go overboard on it, so I think this will be a nice. I mean, I might get this little charger cover piece that we have a carbon fiber overlay for. Should be pretty nice, but we'll see. We're gonna add some heat to it real quick. Now she's ready to install. We're just gonna line it up before we set it down. Try to get this middle piece in that kind of dips in. This edge lined up. I think she's good like that. So we're gonna add some pressure to the edges, hold that down, and then go from the back to the front and just push her down. So hold that with some pressure for about five to 10 seconds. I'm gonna take a microfiber towel, just add some pressure and go along each edge across the entire surface. Make sure they get inside of there. I recommend take a clean microfiber cloth and just use that to press it down. If for some of these you gotta actually like press it down on each side and hold it down for a little bit just to make it sure it's 600%. So one side doesn't just pop up like that. Now last but not least is the speaker door surround cover right here. So you take off the tape and add some heat to it and then get it installed. Let's add some heat. And once it's heated up, just want to put it around the edge. Make sure you follow each line. Kind of going from this corner first, 
push it up around this, and then get the rest of it. And make sure you go from inside to out. So just make sure it's as close as it can be. Make sure it's pushed down 100%. Hold it like this for about five seconds while I'm adding some pressure. As you can see, it's pretty much good to go, but I'm gonna push it down with a microfiber towel just all the way around. Just make sure it has a nice stick to it. Make sure that bitch doesn't come off. Out of every option we have for the Camaro, this is probably the hardest one to install. It's just a flimsy piece, and you kind of have to bend it around the speaker trim. Once you get it, it's pretty pretty easy. Just give it some patience and some. Just give it some patience and pressure, and you'll be good. And she's all installed, ready to go. So we got these officially installed. It was pretty easy as you could see. Nice haul quality carbon fiber pieces for the interior, making it look out, pop out a lot better. As you can see with these three pieces right here, including the navigation, radio screen cover, start and stop button cover, and also the dash overlay, it completes the interior and makes it look honestly awesome. Get the window switch panel cover installed. Look at that gloss. Looks out much better than the stock one that they had. And then the speaker trim, surround cover. This is a nice little touch for the carbon fiber. Nothing major, but it does make it stand out for sure. But that is all for today's video, guys. If you'd like to subscribe for more, if you guys want to check out these parts, make sure to check out nextgenspeed.com. Got the product links in the description below with all the products in this video. So be sure to check it out. That's all for today. Please like and subscribe for more. I will see you guys next time.